If you want to disable pop-up ads on your Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra, so try one of these four methods. So first of all, open up your settings. After that, find your Samsung account. There it is. In your Samsung account, we're gonna find our security and privacy. Open it up. And in privacy settings, let's disable get new special offer and approve personal advertising. There it is. Turn it off. Press stop. Now go back and press turn off as well. And that's it for the first step. The second method is through your browser settings. So open up your browser, whatever you're using. I will use Google Chrome for this one. Uh, now we got to press at three dots and now we got to press settings. Now we got to choose our site settings. In your site settings, find pop ups and pop up ads. Here they are and make sure to, that the switch is turned off. Otherwise, we will have this pop up ads. Uh, the next method is to change our DNA services. So open up your uh, settings, open up your connections tab. Now we're gonna press on our more connection settings. Great. Uh, here, let's tap on private DNS. Uh, so let's tap on private DNS provider host name and let's enter our private DNS. We have to enter the following DS, uh, I'm sorry, DNS dot uh, add ad.ard.com com press save and now it will be saved just give it a couple seconds and you won't get your uh, advertisements and also you can check what's causing those uh, pop-up ads uh, to do that you have to hold your power button and volume down button until you'll get your power off menu, choose your power off, hold it, then press on the safe mode. Now give your phone a couple seconds to be loaded up into safe mode. Uh, so what this mode does, it basically blocks all the third party apps and their influence. So if you want to have any advertisements into your safe mode, it means that your advertisements have been caused by the uh, third party apps. So we have our safe mode. Let's log in. Uh, if you want to uh, exit from your safe mode, simply swipe down from the top of the screen, press on this power button and press restart and your phone will be booted into normal mode. And basically that's it. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and please consider subscribing to our channel.